What's going on, everybody? My name is Chris the Chaos Gamer, and welcome back to Pokemon Snakewood. In the last episode, we defeated the Deadly Seven, and we, um, yeah, we basically defeated the Deadly Seven again. We also went in this house, which is apparently the Endless Plains, and apparently the woman in there likes it in there because it's so dull. Um, I also ended off after seeing that, and apparently that there's a trainer right down here. So, what I'm going to do is, I am going to not do the ship thing quite yet, because that's Briny's ship, or at least I believe it's Briny's ship. And I'm not sure what else is down south. Um, so before we so before we move on, let's do a quick team recap. We have Sapuku, our shift tree, level 42, holding the leftovers with Bide, Feign Attack, Cut, and Fake Out. Next is Gary, our uh, Macargo, level 38, holding the Demon Horn with Yon, Fire Pump, Rock Throw, and Harden. Next is Puffy, our Quill Shark, level 39, holding the Brain Link with Minimize, Headbutt, Water Gun, Pin Missile. Next is Maya, or Gyarados, level 41, holding the Gamblefish with Twister, Storm Surge, Bite, and Surf. Pollock, or Claydol, level 40, not holding anything with Psybeam, Hardened, Hyperbeam, and Ancient Power. And last but not least, we have Terry, our Aerodactyl, level 40, with Bite, Supersonic, Ancient Power, and Scary Phase. So, um, that's our team. Okay, there you go. The zombies couldn't get us because... Because, because we mimicked their every move. I doubt you can take us on. Interesting. Alright. So who are you? Ace Trainer? Mimic Bros. Tomo. Tomo. Turns out a Psy Pig. Fake out. See what this fake out does. Wow. Okay, we got the flinch. Uh, this guy's also part psychic, I believe. So this fake attack should do. Should be super effective. Ooh! Almost died. Almost killed. Almost Oko. Um, that's the speed again. That's fine. We'll go cut. Can you just stop? Ooh. Why? Why did I miss? You can just, you know, take that cut and leave. Alright. Another Psy Pig. That's fine. Because we get ourselves more uh, fame attacks. So. I'm curious as to what happens if I talk to that Mrs. actually. Like, is that going to force us back? Like, force us to another area? I'm not sure. I kind of don't want to do it quite yet. I want to see what else is here first. Alright. Um, now the question is, do I have any repels? I don't think I do. So what's this item? Super repel. Okay. Okay, there we go. We're just that good at mimicking. That's cool, I guess. Cinnabar sends out Kajillionth? You have Wonder Guard. Okay. Time to figure out what you are and how to defeat you. Okay. Fain attack? So normal type moves don't affect it. Dark type moves will. Good. Ah, uh, you're that one guy that has the one HP. That's cool. Sapuku's now level 43. Awesome. Puffy's also now level 40. Trying to learn takedown. Uh, I mean, sure. Oh, I forgot. I'm gonna give. Um, I'm gonna get rid of minimize. Um. Something I said I was going to do episodes ago, and I didn't do it. I'm going to do it right now. After seeing Water Gun, I'm going to replace that Water Gun and give Puffy Surf. 
because I completely forgot about that before. I'm doing it now! <laughs> okay. Um, let's see what else. Anything else? That was the guy I defeated earlier. I was gonna say, I'm surprised we haven't hit any wild encounters yet. And there's Zigzagoons. Zigzagoon. Stop. I'm not gonna catch you. Okay, here's another one. We are the Mimic Bros. How many are how many are there of you? This is your this is the third one. Floatzel sends out Roselia. Interesting. Alright, let's fake him out. Ooh. That was good damage. Uh, leftovers. Let's go with a cut. Sweet set. That's fine. Lower my evasiveness. That's fine. I want to keep as much uh, as much of uh, PP of faint faint attack as I can. Now I know there's a healing bag right close by, but you know I don't know how far down I got to go. Swellow, I am gonna change. Um, let's go into Poic. I mean, technically, I could have went out into uh, Terry as well. Go with an Ancient Power double team. This Ancient Power is probably not going to hit. Probably will never hit now. Oh no, it does hit. I'll take it. Oh, double team again. This uses a double team and swallow. But Poet still breaks through? Oh, are you serious? That one little teeny tiny bit. Wow. He actually survived on three. That's hilarious. Uh, let's go with the side beam. Yeah. I kind of figured that. I kind of figured that was what, that's what is uh, that's what he was gonna do. Let's send out Terry. Um, this is actually the first time. No, not the first time. This is one of the first times that Terry's actually seeing some battles. <laughs> Incredible. Alright, let's get ourselves off of the grass. Because it doesn't look like that there's any other anybody else. Uh oops. So I'm gonna go. I'm not gonna go anywhere. I have six revives left. I'm gonna revive Poic. And let's see what's down here. Whoa jeez. Hello. They call me Dr. Blackthorn. Who might you be? I'm Chris. I see. That egg you carry. It's intriguing. May I see it? No, it's kind of valuable. What's going on? What? Uh, could that be? The egg containing Meteor's daughter? Yeah, as a matter of fact, why? What's going on? Will someone please tell me? Quiet. The adults are talking. What's it to you, Doc? I had heard that someone just attacked the vault and that Meteor's daughter had been freed, so I came rushing over to see if it was true. Thank you for your time. Wait, yes? Do you know where I can find Meteor so I can take his daughter back to him? I believe you ought to head east to Moss Deep to find his current abode. Now if you have finished... No, sorry, but just who are you? A concerned party. Let's just say no. Let's let us say no more than that. Hmm. Like you, the current state of affairs worries me, and I am on my own small mission to resolve some of the issues that face this region. I see. Sorry to have bothered you. Not at all. Might I offer some piece, small piece of advice? Sure. These are troubling times, Chris. Please remember that in this region, almost everyone will lie to you. I will not claim that you can trust me, but I will tell you that there are fewer than 20 honest people left in Hoenn, and that you and I are two of them. Please bear this in mind, and take care. Okay. Um. The zombie has been nailed through a sign, one through each shoulder. Wonder what the sign says. Let's peek behind the zombie. Oh god, it's coming back to life. Okay. 
Um, so I gotta get, I gotta head east to Moss Deep. How exactly do I get to Moss Deep? That is the million dollar question. Maybe that ship that I saw earlier? I'm willing to bet that that's how I get there. Because Moss Deep is kind of, you know, an island. Um... I'm just trying to think now. Do... Do I... Sapuku with the crit! Come on, man. Alright. Um... Send out Yuck. I'm guessing this is a Muck. Whoa! Um... Muck... Uh, Muck, you kind of have a, a human head coming out of your mouth. You should probably get that checked out. How much is this faint attack going to do? Not a lot, but I'll take it, I guess. <sighs> this will heal me back up. Yes, it does. Okay, so the zombie came back to life, and there's a few humans in around here, so I'm thinking this is like some sort of like retreat or something. Man, that minimize ain't gonna do crap to you. For you. Wow. Zombie le le liver? Le I almost said lever. It's lever. Liver. I can't talk. Man, it's a poo -coo. You're critting. Keep going. I love this. Alright. <laughs> Why? Alright, let's use Fan Attack again because Fan Attack never misses. I was gonna cut, but he already minimized like three times. Alright, so because of the two guys standing next to each other, Morton gave a depressing sigh and fell back against the sign. Can I see what the sign said? A penetrating look. Uh, these guys are a double battle, aren't they? I don't know. The other, the other ones were. I'm... I'm, I'm assuming I take that ship. You guys are... Yeah. You again. Change your mind about joining the army at all? I don't remember fighting you guys before. Recruiters Tina and Bruce. Cedra and Matang. Okay. Um... Sapuku, so I want you to fake out the Cedra. Gary... I want you to come. I want you to come. I want you to come back, and I'm gonna bring Maya out. Get the intimidate drop on these guys for one. Oh, you have clear body. That's fine. How much is this gonna do to Cedra? Eh. That metal claw was going to Sabuku, which is nice. Okay. Um. Hmm. Fain attack the Seedra and Maya. Uh... Let's surf. I'm willing. I am willing to bet. I am willing to bet that that uh, that that ship I saw back there at the beginning of the episode. I'm pretty sure that is where I take the. I'm pretty sure that's how I get to Masti. I'm like 90 per I'm like 80 90 percent sure that's where I go so we're gonna continue on going down south um, and just see how how far we can go because I'm thinking that um, that if we keep going down the way we're going that will take us back to um, Marvel so even if I can get myself back to Marvel at the end of this uh, at the end of this episode, at least I'm hope. Great, you're a million times more powerful than the last time we fought you. Want to join the army? No? Okay, okay. A little quote on the spot perfectly. How about no? Okay, um... Okay, so it looks like we'll be getting the Mava a little bit quicker than before. Uh, we'll pick up these citrus berries. I'm gonna talk to that scientist. Um, because there's a scientist over here. I don't know if you're a trainer or not. Something's telling me you are. Because I'm taking on all the trainers. Because I feel like I'm a little bit underleveled. 
Oh, that's a mush mask. Oh, may I please have it? I do love mushrooms, so... No, how about I offer this rare and expensive item in exchange? Sure. A cologne. Okay, what does a cologne do for me? And I found another broken heart. Okay. Um... What exactly does the cologne do? Expensive, nutritious cologne. And tasty, too. I don't know how I feel about that. Now, if I remember correctly, heading this way... In the original... <laughs> so hard, you both fell into a small hole. No escape, it's clombering time. Okay. So, if I remember correctly... Heading east here... Gets me... To... The Berry Master's house. Um... We also got ourselves a scissor. See how much this faint attack does. I don't think it's going to do all that much, honestly. No, I didn't think so. That was a crit. Um, yeah. I might just swap out into Macargo and see how much a fl uh, and just see how much I'm doing a hard switch here. Ah, you're using the zombie le liver. That's awesome. That's great. Use this fire pump. Take this fire pump to your face. Because you're probably bug steel at this. Because you're bug steel. You're quite weak to fire. Or at least you should be. <laughs> Hell yeah, you are. Gary, level 39. Very nice. Puffy's now level 41. I might give the brain link to someone else now. Having destroyed half its head, well, half of it was missing anyway. The pit mysteriously disappears. Alright. Whoa! Okay, a little bit of graphical glitch. But yeah, the berries! Awesome. We're picking up a lot of berries today, boys! Alright, what does this say? Route 20, Route 123. I feel like there should be an item here. There's an item over there, which I will get. What do you say? Whoa! Calling! Alright. My friends will be here soon. It's time to see who's the strongest. Who are you? T Fanger Ran Mao? the f what what is what what the what <laughs> um what what is this thing why is it why is all of its name all in lowercase I don't want to see stun spore okay uh, we're paralyzed that's fine as long as... Let's take this cut. Swords Dance! Oh! Okay. That's cool. Oh, I missed. Why did I have to miss? Alright. So... Swords Dance again! This is a four stage. Okay. Please hit this cut. Thank you. Um... Interesting. Oosh. All right, let's send out Gary. So I'm not sure what this guy, is, what this message is all about. Man, this thing. Oh, you protect really? Ah, uh, come on. Fire pump, bone rush. That's gonna hurt. Can you stop? Can you stop? Can you please stop? Oh. Um, take this fire pump, please. That fire pump does nothing. Okay, okay, okay. We're getting out of there. We're going into Maya. Okay, that was actually a bit scary. He's probably gonna bone club again. Here, take this intimidate. Screech. Lower my speed. Defense. And take the surf to the face. 
There we go. Whew. Okay. Uh, Rude Dance? What the? Rude Dance? Whoa. What are these things? These are ma- these are- that thing's amazing looking. He looks like a Beyblade. <laughs> He has speed boost. Oh no. Can you not hit protective thing? Thank you. Brew dance. Man, okay, so you're probably more than likely double team. Okay, I was like, he's probably going to protect again, but I guess not. I'm curious as to what her MO is for just randomly fighting me. Anyway. Ah, damn it, guys. You have to do better than that. Hang on, my D-shot needs charging. And it's a crypto. What do you want? Whoa, you can talk. Yeah, of course, I'm not a Pokemon. I am a Denju. Denju? Okay. I'm just gonna take these berries and I'll be on my way. <sighs> Alright. So I'll return to normal. It's gonna do his normal loomy state. Soft and loamy state. Alright. All the berries. Give me all the berries. <sighs> There's also an item I need to get. Oh my god, what's up with my nose? Ugh, so itchy. Alright. Um, an item down here that I want. It's an Ultra Ball. I'll take it. I'll take an Ultra Ball. Uh, what's up here? Okay. Um, you're probably going to attack me, so I'm just going to surf. What is this place? You're probably going to attack me too. We're at 22 minutes. You know what? Um. Wait. Okay, can you tell me where I am? Battle me if you win, I'll tell you. Whoa! My character is battle me. Rodance and oh, this is a double battle. Sapuku and Gary. Um, Gary, you need to get out of here. I don't want to hit a thing, guess Gasu. And I'm gonna send Maya back out because you took um excellent work of the pre-evolution to to Fangu Gasu earlier. So let's fake that. You know what? I should have faked out Rude Dance. Rude Dance first. Mmm, don't know how I feel about Clay Doll being out, but we can try it. So I do have Hyper Beam. <sighs> yeah, you have Speed Boost. I f Both of them have Speed Boost. Uh oh. Alright, let's Hyper Beam the Rude Dance. Or not. They have corn attack. Hyper beam miss. I got faint attack. That was, oh, I, I doubled up on that slot. Rude and speed booze. Sort of fan gasu. This is fun. <laughs> this is fun. Alright. Let's faint attack the root ants and let's hyper beam the root ants. Extreme speed. Um shouldn't? Okay. Sapuku should take it. There we go. Let's hyper beam the Rude Dance. Ooh, that's good. Okay. Okay, Rude Dance is gone. All the experience. Alright. Um, he's probably going to go after Pollock again. So what I could do is not on Sapuku's turn, but, uh, oh, I got to recharge. Right. 
I forgot. Um, on Pollock's next turn, I'll hard switch into Gyarados. Man, that speed boost. Oh, with the amount of damage that Faint Attack just did, that faint, uh, the Faint Attack should actually should kill. Now that I think about it. We'll send Omea anyway. Get the Intimidate drop, just so, just in case. There's a Horn attack, and that was going to the Poet slot. I figured. And we'll Faint Attack. Is this going to kill? No. Almost. Almost kill. That's cool. That's great. That's cool. 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 All right. Um. Let's faint attack and surf. Ugh. Oh, excuse me. I just stretched there for a second. All right. Man, you gave off like no. You give off like no experience. No fair. What the hell are those things you have? They're not sure. Din Denju. What is this place? Oh, I'm not even gonna bother to answer her, apparently. What? Where am I? Um, okay. Right, okay. Um, so I'm gonna end things off here. Um, I'm also gonna fight this one down here, too. Um, just to see. And, uh, anyway, yeah. Because this area is a bit weird. Because apparently these, these ladies have never seen Pokemon before. So I'm going to leave things off here and we'll continue on in the next episode. So if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to click that thumbs up button like you never clicked it before. And subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one. I've been Chris the Chaos Gamer, and I will see you in the next video.